Hello friends, this is Koshik from Living Image and I hope you are well. So today I'm going to show you how to connect your Canon camera with your computer. We need to connect our camera with our computer for various purposes such as live shooting, transporting files and also for broadcasting on social medias on YouTube or any other platform. So I'm going to show you everything step by step how to install the software and also to shoot using this software. Let's get started. So at first we need to download EOS utility software. Please note that Windows and Mac users need to download different softwares. Same but just different version for Windows and Mac. So since um, I've been using Mac, I'm going to download a dedicated software for Mac. So let's do that. I'm going to type US utility for Mac. So I'm going to hit on this. So make sure that you are not going to download anything from any unknown um, website or platform or make sure that you are going to download the software from uh, Canon website that would be safer for you and also um, make sure that you are downloading the latest version otherwise it may not work for your computer system. So I'm going to download this. Download has been completed. There will be a zip file, so you'll have to unzip it. And then you can see. This file and you need to double hit on this. And then you will come here. So you will have to hit on this installer button. and it is not necessary but there's no harm mentioning your location so since I'm doing it from Asia I'm choosing my country and location and then you know you can just simply download one of these software because you may not need all of this so I'm just installing US utility 3 and then hit yes complete your password here hit next I don't need that Then you are done. So you need uh, HDMI cable and you need to connect it with your um, camera and computer. This part needs to be connected with your HDMI port on your camera. So as you can see this is this is a Canon camera 8000D so this part you can see the smaller size port and here you need to connect your HDMI cable so it's been connected so now I'm going to connect this part with my computer one thing you need to keep in mind that the camera is on otherwise software will not work so as you can see now we are on this window so it has opened automatically because uh, the camera and computer is going to start with the connection. So as you can see there are three options. So if you'd like to download any image then or any file then you need to hit on this and select what you want to download or take it in your computer. So I'm going to main window again and then camera setting set all general things here 
and then the remote shooting so from here we are going to do different things as you can see you can take photo by clicking on this so the photo has been taken so you can change the aperture if you want to you can use the, use the exposure compensation now we are going to see how live view shooting works so from here as you can see now actually I set my camera for recording this video so and from here you can adjust your white balance you can change your focus mode you can set your sound if you wish to and if you're happy then it's fine and then if you want to record then you need to hit on this now it's been recording on my camera as you can see so guys it's quite useful actually when you have this axis and i can control it from here so it's been working and this is how you also can take photos you can record videos and i hope this video will help you to uh, maybe get this then uh, set up this software to control your camera from the computer so thank you for watching